On the road to Glenorchy, you can turn right up to Moak Lake Road through the forest, winding through the trees. We then return down and drop into the hawk's nest from above, which overlooks the lake, Walter Peak, Cecil Peak and the Remarkables mountain range. The brief called for a modern mountain home and it had to have the Queenstown look and feel. Um, so that called for stone, timber and glass. The house is laid out along the contour running east to west rather than down the ridge line. Uh, it captures the sun to the north and the expansive views to the south. Client requests of the original brief included interesting things like a good mudroom, a big view from their main entry, good home office and a covered outdoor living space. Central to the brief was um, wellness areas including gym, sauna and hot tub. While the house has an impressive main entrance for visitors and guests, they're a very active and adventurous family. So the mudroom and locker room was important and it's a space where they can spend time rather than just move through. So you enter the house through a central gable which gets the sun from the north and then opens to the views to the south. To the west for late sun is the main living spaces. The kitchen, dining and living spaces are mirrored by outdoor kitchen, dining and living spaces and the fires too are mirrored. One of the interesting challenges with this project was COVID. The client was unable to travel from Australia so we had to finish construction without them being able to visit the property. We questioned whether we should stop the project and start again when they could come back or carry on. Um, we chose to carry on and then we grouped together as a team with more technology uh, and yeah, we learnt a lot along the way. Being a modern mountain home, we needed generous volumes and tall spaces, but also compression and release, so a comfy den and a snug. Snugs and media rooms are important. They're one of the few rooms in the house with carpet. Increasingly, we're using hard surfaces. So uh, being able to curl up and also have a TV on the wall where we, we keep the TVs away from the fireplace. The house is a base for skiing and biking and walking in the area. And then at the end of the day, there's amenities to um, unwind, soak in the hot tub, have a sauna, and then end up in the downstairs bar. One of the satisfying things about this project is we've been able to deliver a, a modern mountain home that calls on traditional mountain style architecture. It's an enduring house that will serve the family well for years to come.